Hello everyone, this is All Out 58 with my Let's Play Episode 5. We are here looking at our Pretty Things chest. We're going to get a diamond. And let's get some... Do we have any iron in this chest? We have some ore. I want some ingots. No. Okay, that's okay. We will take one of these. Run over to our smeltery. Um, today, I was kind of debating getting started in a mod called Thermal Expansion, but you need a lot of resources for that, and especially things like um, diamonds and uh, not as much other things, but a lot of the other stuff I already have. But you really need a lot of diamonds sometimes uh, for some parts of it. So, um, I need more diamonds, and I know an excellent way to get some in the uh, enchanted forest of, oh darn, I don't remember what it's called. Uh, let me get this smelting up. And we'll go look through some of the cool items that we have for this mod. It is called, oh, I don't remember what it's called. Why don't I remember what it's called? Twilight Forest. Alright. We are going to the Twilight Forest. And it is a very crazy, 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 crazy place. So, we will get started collecting some of the stuff that we are going to need to get into the Twilight Forest. We're going to need some of this. Let's get some flowers. Basically, you just need a bunch of nature-y things. Any kind of flower. Um, tree saplings will work, but that's a really bad idea. Trust me. Um, that's, oh, that's not what I wanted to do. I wanted to eat. Oh, hey, my portal gun's... No, it's not. Yes, I don't know what's wrong with the portal gun. Okay. Do we have any meat? No, we don't. Thank you. Alright. Um, this might be enough. We might need to get some more stuff. Ooh, a new kind of bush. I think this is a blueberry bush. Hmm. Uh, there's some more flowers over there. Hopefully by the time we've done collecting all of our pretty flowers, the... Ooh, enderpearl. hey -o. Very nice. Ooh, um, sheep. I've been needing to get a bed for a while here. Awesome. Oh, and a ravine. How about that? Ooh, ooh, ooh. We need to get down there. Okay, I'm gonna set a waypoint. Waypoints. Uh, new waypoints. Uh, ravine. Don't want it in the nether. Okay. Because... That thing? It's another or kind of orberry bush that gives us... Oh, no, do not want to throw that on the ground. That gives us, um... Lots of experience. It gives you little ore berries, but these ore berries are a little bit different than normal, and they actually give you uh, experience. You just eat them, and they give you experience. It's kind of strange, but interesting way of doing things. I love all these hats. Ooh, 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 oh my word. Okay, now we said that this doesn't work, right? Okay. Let's put some lights here. Let's go ahead and set a white point. I can't spell gold. I can't type. That's my problem. Set a nice gold color. That's a nasty gold color, but it'll work. Nice. Very nice. Totems. Okay. Hopefully that iron will have finished smelting up by now. 
really need to get myself a sword before I go. Maybe we can do a little bit of Tinker's Construct sword stuff. Nah. We'll wait for later until we get some really good stuff to make swords out of. I can't run because I don't have any food. That's okay. Okay. Very good. Doo -doo. Let's eat some blueberries and some raspberries. Yummy, yummy, yummy. Nom, 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 nom. Alright, there we go. Alright. Let's go over to our little crafting table. Wait. Oh, yeah. I haven't shown you this yet. Okay. The minium stone is really cool. First of all, you saw me transmute stuff. Guess what? Oh yeah, and you can actually transmute blocks in the world. If you hit the G key by default, it changes what it turns it into. You see the little red thing down in the bottom right corner? Changing around. So, well, because it's changing it into what it already is. But like if I went and changed this, I love that sound. Okay. And the other thing that was really useful is if you hit C, it brings up a crafting table. Awesome. Okay, now we just need to make a bucket. That's, yeah, all we needed the stuff for. Okay, water. We need two buckets of water. You could, it's not like time sensitive, so you could just uh, get it and then come back and then get it. But I need another bucket eventually anyways, it doesn't matter. Okay, let's go over to our little portal area. Do do do. Let's make it like um, I could have just gotten the water right there. Wow. Do I have? No, I don't. That's fine. Let's make it right here. away my portal guns right now. That there, this there, that da, da, do do do. Okay, put water there and put water there. Basically you're just creating four by four infant water source. But it's yeah, it's no different than normal. Okay, and this we're gonna want and this we're gonna want. Alright. Flower and okay. Let's do this, and this, and this. Oh, I can't do that there. Basically, you just need natural things all around outside here. Okay, and one more over here in this corner. Alright. Oh yeah, there's one thing I want to do first. Maybe I can, I don't remember. Nah, I'll be okay. Alright, now. You want to be careful because this produces actual lightning. So we're going to want to stand back, stand back, just toss it in there. Oh, it, it worked, okay. Alright, Twilight Force Portal. Um, I'm going to borrow my portal gun here and st stick it on the edge of my portal. That thing's so annoying. Okay, I need some food. Oh, glass, thank you. And stone, I don't know why I have stone in there. And copper, that's very nice. Okay. Getting some food. Let's see what of this I can put away. UA, put UA, put UA, put UA, put UA, put UA. These are handy dandy. Medium stone. Oh, quiet. That's not where I wanted you. Alright, let's see if we can lay down in here. There are monsters nearby. Oh, I thought so. Now 
now let's see there we go finally a bed yeah it's taking us five episodes to get a bed but that's okay there's other more important things to do okay seriously be quiet we'll just chew and get some lamb chop let's see if yeah I can put that in there I got hurt. Alright, things we will not need in there. We will not need buckets. We can get rid of that. No. Let's get a stack of cobble, just for good measure. Um we will not need this, 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 this. I'm just gonna take one bucket. Don't need sand. Don't need dirt. Alright, I think we're about ready. I'm gonna make myself another stone sword. I'm just kinda waiting until I get to the point where I uh, feel like I can actually do a good job building a sword material wise. So, yeah, that's why it's. That's why we're not messing with Tinker's Contract Swords. They're cool and all, it's just I don't uh, feel comfortable enough with them to know exactly what all the materials do. I'm just, I need to play around in single player uh, test world. Our berry bushes are coming quite along. Okay, let's... let's um, Let's go, let's go make a, uh, iron shovel. So I need one of those. Jump through here. Run back over to my smeltery. Stick you in there. Pull that off. And let's get a... Tough tool rod and a shovel. Have I not made a shovel yet? Oh, I guess I haven't. Let's get this out of here before it melts. <clears throat> okay, where's my aluminum brass? What happened to all my aluminum brass? Did I use up all my aluminum brass? I don't think I could have used up all my aluminum brass. This is unnerving. Oh, well, let's just make up some more. I think it's, no, it's one of these and three of these, I think. Alright, and yep, okay, we're going to need to run back to the house again and get ourselves the... Yep, okay, stick this here. Do -do. Okay. We will be going through that portal soon, I promise. I just want to get all geared up properly. Don't want to be... I think different things take different amounts of time to actually melt because like I stuck the aluminum and the copper in about the same time and the copper's taking a lot longer. I need to get some more fuel in there. Alright, four ingots. More than enough. Alright, well that's hardening. Let's get an ingot cast. Ingot and this. And stick that in there to be smelting. Doop, 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 do. There you go. Let's eat. That's strange. Should be making the eating thing. Oh well. What do we need to make a shovel? We need a 
tool rod and the shovel head. So we're gonna have a little bit extra iron, not the best. That's okay, I guess. Shovel head. All right, pour that in there. Boom, boom, and this. Okay, and I think that's it. Uh, there should be a little bit, yeah. So I'm not exactly sure what we're gonna do with that, but um, we'll be able to use it at some point, I assume. Actually, let's go ahead and make another iron tool rod. Cause I'm sure we'll use this at some, uh, eh, uh, uh, I don't know. We'll put that there for now. We'll, we'll worry about that later. Okay, put that up. Let's make us a stone shovel. Different places. Okay, there we go. Alright, so let's put that up here. Alright, I think we're ready. Let's go to the Twilight Forest. Yay! Oh wait, do I have building? Yeah, I have building materials. Okay. Actually, I'm gonna get some more. Because you never know when you're gonna need some more cobblestone. You never know. Alright. And in we go. Do 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 do. Down on the terrain. I take a little while because it's actually ginning the world. It's a totally different dimension, just like the Nether, just like the End. But it's actually got a lot more stuff than either, because it's actually more like an overworld. So this might take a while. Um, I'll be back when it's done. Where we ended up? Okay, not too bad. Um, alright, I'm going to build, yeah, it's a little bit crazy, guys. I'm going to build a nice little, um, bunker. <laughs> and, uh, lagging. I will be back once I've built the bunker and we're ready to go exploring. Alright. in the Twilight Forest for the overworld. I came back, I got to, I had to get some more stone, and look what I got. My iron pick will actually get the stuff up. Hoorah! So, now we can go get that other gold ore that's over there somewhere, I think. Eventually. I still want to deal with the Twilight Forest for a while, so. I just wanted to show you guys that. I'll be back once I actually get done with the um, building the building. Bye. Uh, just a little base I built here. This is just a big room. I didn't bother cutting down the trees because, yeah. <laughs> Shouldn't cause any problems. We'll need to get an actual door in here soon. But, yeah, for now, this is what we got. And we step outside and there's already something over here. Let's go look at that. Um, yes, there are baddies around that will hurt you. There's some that are worse than normal, but most of them are fine. Let's get some more moss cobble. Can never have too much of this stuff with Tinker's Construct. Um, what we're going for is we're trying to find a ma magic Yes, a magic map focus, which requires glowstone, which we'll have to get back to the overall and get some torch berries and a raven feather. A raven feather is a drop from a raven. Um, it's a bird that is on the ground, actually, I believe. Oh, wow, another one. Okay. Anything interesting in this one? No, that's fine. 
you have green stone, and I will take your green stone. Oh, Raven, somewhere near here. Let's see if we can find him. Oh, yes, Raven. All right. Now I'm going to want to clear away this stuff so I can get a good shot at him. All right, Raven Feather. Yay. Now we need to go. Oh, hey, perfect. It's a great looking place. Basically, we just have to go down. Oh, some loot. Okay, I may go look under that other house and see if there's any loot. That's fine for now. Ooh, iron. Can't ever have enough iron. Well, that was not what exactly what I was looking for. That's okay, though. I do like my new shovel. It's very nice. Alright. I'm going to dig down here. Alright. Well, oh, yep, there's something. Not too bad, not too bad. Still not quite what I'm looking for, but that's okay. I'm looking for torchberries now. They... Actually, let's see if any has the torchberry bush. Um... Yes, it looks like this. And it hangs from the ceilings in um, caves and such. So basically, we're just caving. Die, zombie! Okay. Um, I think I found some. Uh, but there's a creeper down there. I'd rather not blow up if possible. Ah, here we go. Uh, did it just disappear? Wow. Wow, really? Well, that stinks. Those Endermen are getting really annoying. Stuff just keeps randomly disappearing, and I don't know exactly why. That's fine. Here's some torchberries. Please don't disappear. Why does it keep disappearing? Okay, that's really weird. I have not seen it do that before. Let's wait and heal up. Um, put you away, put you away, do do do. Got a lot of food now. Jeez. <laughs> Must be a spider spawn or something back there. Disappointed. I keep seeing these torch bears and they keep disappearing. I don't really know why. This looks interesting. Maybe. And yes, that little blue guy is a new mob that spawns. Light it up a little bit. They're a little bit annoying. They're not too bad, but they're called kobolds. And they drop gold ingots, which is nice. Oh, 
Ah, hey. Not cool, dude. Not cool. Can always use these force gems. Alright. Let's try to put up this and this. Oh, really looking for some torch berries. Um, strange, I keep seeing them and then they keep disappearing. Um, I think I'm going to pause and come back when I find some torch berries. And then we can actually really get started in here. Alright, be back in a sec. Figured out what to do. Um, now if you look at the thing, for some reason it disappears. I don't know why, but it does. If you look directly at it. So, what I've found is they have to hang from the ceiling. So, if I take out the block above them on the ceiling, then they drop. So, I don't know why, I don't know anything about that, but, ouch. But, that did give me some berries. So, this is interesting. This is cool looking. If there's anything at the bottom. I'm probably just going to drown. Yeah, let's not do that. Because I don't have any kind of suit to help me not die. World gen. Okay. Uh, let's try to find our way back home here. I probably need to set a waypoint now that I think about it. <laughs> Alright, let's go home get some glowstone dust. And this is about time to wrap up, but we are going to, actually it's in this direction, isn't it? We are going to, see, there it goes, repair. Uh, creeper, creeper, lots of creepers, lots of creepers, lots of creepers, run, boom. If I just run, they won't find me. I doubt that, but... And if I keep telling myself that, oh my word, that's a lot of roses. There's somebody after me. Haha, <laughs> dumb angry zombie. Wow, he's got really good pathing. Let's go. I don't feel like dying just because it's night. Now nah, you can't get me. Ha ha ha. Alright. Cook land chop, please. Let's see the water on. I've got so much food now. This is very nice. I wish I hadn't gotten a cooked potato. I wish it was uncooked potato. Because now I can't plant it. But that's okay. Okay. Let's try to sleep. Okay, good, we can sleep. Um, tomorrow morning, right now, let's get some of this, one of these. Let's craft this thing up. All right, the other two things, the other the raven feather I've put in my pack, right here. I'm gonna need some of this, I think, eventually. Alright, that, and that, and that, gives me a magic mech focus, that's cool, and I think I need a bunch of paper, so I may actually have to go get some paper, yeah, wow, okay, I will be back in a second once I have some paper, and I will be back. We're about to make our magic blank map. Alright, we'll hop back in real quick, but it's about time to wrap up. But I really want to show you this. This is cool. It's not just like a normal map. Um, if you've seen the... Well, I'm sure you've seen the normal vanilla Minecraft maps. They just show the terrain. Well, this shows not only the terrain... Oh, darn. You have to be a little bit careful when you come out of your Twilight Portal because... Um, 
yeah, sometimes you'll end up like this. And that I wanted to do the last time I didn't. Okay, so look down, figure out which direction it is, and then walk away. All right, so let's just do the normal map thing, yada, yada, yada. Okay, now those symbols that popped up on the map, they represent different things. Like the one that is in this direction, the little, uh, well, it just jerked. This right there. Um, that is a small hill. The one that's kind of just over a little bit up from it. That's, uh, I think, probably a medium hill. And these different hills have different, um, different, they're like different tiers of dungeons. And so we're going to go head over for this one. I need to eat. Um, let's see, what should I eat? Let's eat. Let's eat a uh, cooked chicken. No, let's eat a lamb chop. Okay. And actually, what I'm going to do is do portal. Because portals do not um, go across dimensions. So you can actually use the same portal gun in multiple dimensions. So like, it's perfectly fine for me to have a portal here and two portals in this dimension and then the two portals in overworld. That's perfectly fine. So, there's that bug again. I don't know what that is. I'll see if I can report that to somebody. So now we can get home quick and easy. And we're going to go exploring. I'll see you all next time. Bye.